हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू माय यूट्यूब चैनल माय नेम इज़ प्रियंद्र कुमार एंड टुडे वी विल लर्न हाउ टू क्रिएट अ बैटरी चार्ट इन माइक्रोसॉफ्ट एक्सेल सो एज यू आर सीइंग आई हैव क्रिएटेड दिस बैटरी चार्ट सो बेसिकली वी कैन क्रिएट बैटरी चार्ट टू सो केस सम के और यानी एस एल मैट्रिक्स सो हेयर एज यू आर सींग आई हैव सो केस दिस सर्विस लेवल परसेंटेज ऑन दिस बैटरी चार्ट so i have connected this service label with this spin button however in your dashboard or in your report you will take the actual service label value so if i will click on this spin button the service label will be changed accordingly and the graph also will change accordingly fine so let's start how we can create this graph in microsoft excel so i will create the graph this graph in new worksheet so i am creating a new worksheet here and will create the the, the same graph here so let's start first of all i will zoom this worksheet so that you can view properly so here i am taking the service level okay here we will get the service level value in your report or in your dashboard if you want to create this graph so you will connect the service level or any other matrix from your direct data here i am connecting the service level from a spin button so i will insert the spin button from the developer tab and select insert and select the spin button from form controls drag it here right click on the spin button select form controls now we will give the minimum and maximum value for the spin button the minimum minimum value will be the zero because our service level minimum service level can be the zero and the maximum service level can be the hundred i'm giving the incremental one and the sale link will be this click on ok now check yes so spin button has been linked with this uh, with the c2 cell and the service level is showcasing here let me highlight this i'm just highlighting with this color now we will create the battery graph for this service level S before creating the battery graph we have to take some support data here so for support data i'm taking the upper cap value and uh, the actual uh, service level or actual data so i'm taking service level upper cap value will be the 5 service level will be the your actual value whatever it is the remaining part or remaining value remaining value will be the so maximum service level can be 100 we have achieved this the remaining is this fine 100 minus the actual value and for lower cap we will take value as 5 so we have prepared this data for graph now select this data go to the insert tab and select column select the stacked cylinder click okay now graph has been created so we have to go to the de design tab already we are in design tab and click on switch row column fine now select the legend delete this we can make the graph little bit of a smaller like that fine now we can remove the rest thing like uh, vertical axis select horizontal axis and delete select floor and delete select grid lines and click uh, delete uh, press delete button okay now select 
so now uh, select this cylinder right click and uh, select the format data series now gap depth as 0 ok no gap as 0 go to the border color select solid and the gray one already selected ok close this now right click again on cylinder go to the 3d rotation the x value should be 0 and the y value is 10 click ok fine now select the the first cap upper cap and the fill it as gray color this one and same color in the lower cap and the middle value which is remaining value and the service level value first of all I am filling the remaining value this one select only this uh, area and you can fill it as green and fill the transparency as 75 percent fine and the service level value double click and fill it as solid fill and the green close now select the chart area right click go to the format chart area now border color as no line fine now graph is ready fine now we can format the sheet also go to the view click on headings remove the headings uncheck uncheck the grid lines now select this data go to the home and change the font color as white now your graph is ready vertical chart is ready you also can give the at the data level for the service level select the service level only right click and add data level now select the data level and change the color as white and make it bold now check so same graph has been created which we have created on seat 1 this one so friends this is the method you can create the vati chart in your dashboard or reports I hope you have enjoyed this video so friends please share it with your colleagues and friends and if you have not subscribed my channel so far please subscribe it for the updates and thank you so much for the watching